My Maybell is based on uh, Maybell Blair, um, one of the original um, baseball playing gals who is now 95. You may see her about town with her bedazzled <laughs> shades, Louisville slugger cane, hair, nails. She's a force um, and is incredibly spunky and sassy. So I was trying to just inhabit some of that. A League of Their Own comes out on Prime Video August 12th, uh, based on the 1992 film. Um, were you fans of the film? And what would you consider the biggest difference between the ser uh, the series and the movie? Was a fan of the film, uh, like, like everyone. Um, biggest difference, I think, is that we are taking the spirit, the original sort of spunk and spirit of the film, and expanding and going a little bit deeper into who those characters really were, um, which <laughs> Saida can speak to because- There are black people in it. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there are black people in it. There are Latin people in it. There are queer people in it. And we get to learn about them and their lives and their communities. Yeah. Well, Saida, I don't want to ask you this and speaking of, you know, different races in this film, your character, Tony, is, uh, Max's mother. Uh, Max is obviously, obviously one of the main characters. She wants to play baseball. Tony has no interest in her playing baseball. And she's one of the leaders of the Black community, uh, you know, in that city. So um, how fun was it to play that character that's strong and confident and kind of a leader and at the same time had this conflict with her daughter? Well, you know, um, Tony's a little opposite of me. I'm not as strong. No, I'm just playing with you. Yes, it was wonderful. And I've played mothers before. But the thing is, um, I never played a mom who had to deal with this situation of her child finding a way to communicate with her child. This is what I want you to do for your future. This is what I've set up for you. This is the way that I know that you can be protected in this racist and sexist uh, society. And the child says, no, this is what I'm going to do. Right. So letting learning how to let your child go and how to let them be themselves that was the most compelling part for me so and it's hard i'm not a mom but man that's hard oh yeah <laughs> absolutely you know uh, for molly uh you play maybell and one of the things that stood out with to me with her is she kind of reminds me of all the way may play my madonna in the 1992 film um does she remind you of her when you were portraying that character um, a bit, but Maybell, my Maybell is based on uh, Maybell Blair, um, one of the original um, baseball playing gals who is now 95. You may see her about town with her bedazzled <laughs> shades, Louisville slugger cane, hair, nails. She's a force um, and is incredibly spunky and sassy. So I was trying to just inhabit some of that spunk and sass. Absolutely. And the last question for me is, um, this is a great show. I got a chance to check it out. But why should viewers check out this series of A League of Their Own? Well, because it's funny. Mm -hmm. You get to see a lot of women being funny. You get to see an expansion of what life was like for people of color in 1943 and the queer community. You get a fuller, more enhanced version of actual life during that time period. Yeah. And you can learn something. And don't you want to see people in amazing 40s clothes yes. making out? Don't you want to see that? <laughs> yes, absolutely. Come on. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, Molly, Sayeda, thank you so much for your time. I really do appreciate it. Uh, good luck to everything. A continued success to you guys. Mm -hmm.